product demand, actual throughput, scrap and rework, labor and time. These five inputs make up almost all of the necessary factors in almost every calculation of manufacturing metrics within industry today. In one combination or another, using these inputs in various calculations will result in tracking metrics such as overall equipment effectiveness, performance efficiency, parts per labor hour, and operational availability. And the list goes on. So what are these five inputs? The first key input is production demand. Knowing how many of a particular product, production run, or product order your customer requires is this basic metric. This is simple knowledge of how many pieces, units, or pounds are scheduled to be produced during a given duration of time. Pretty simple. Key to any performance metrics is the second input of actual production, especially compared to the previous input of demand. As a matter of fact, it could be said that the most tracked production monitor as to the performance of a process is the comparison of demand versus actual. Once a factory knows how many of a product needs to be produced, then understands how many of that product was actually produced, the next logical question for any production metric will be, how much of the product produced did we have to scrap or rework? This is usually a very difficult input to capture accurately in current MES systems. Knowing the amount of labor used during the production activities on the shop floor gives an input that is rarely available to data analysis. But knowing how many labor hours were used to produce a single product or product orders, or exactly how many hours were used to repair a piece of equipment, is usually data only captured in manual processes and only by the most disciplined of organizations. Our final input is time. This is kind of a catch-all category, but basically all manufacturing metrics are framed around an element of time on a factory floor, such as cycle time, resource time, plant production, shift schedules, and of course, downtime. The difficulty here is that almost every department is using their own clock. So the data never really syncs together concerning these times. The problem facing plant leaders today is that they need two, three, or sometimes even four separate software systems just to capture all five of these inputs. Or even worse, all of this data is captured manually and put on a spreadsheet. At L2L, we have solved this problem of capturing these five key inputs. L2L captures these five key inputs in real time on a single piece of software and calculates your metrics for you in the background and in real time. I'm Eric Whitley with L2L, and if you'd like to see how to capture all five of these inputs on a single system, go to l2l.com or contact us at info at l2l.com and we'll set up a free demo for you. Thanks for watching.